Okay, here we are. It was a quick little video on how to calculate miles per gallon. Now I did it on a Microsoft Excel spreadsheet, but you can also do it on paper. Anyway, for number one, it says that we need to fill up at a gas station and record our mileage. So, let's say it says 65,000 miles. Now, number two says you drive around until you need gas again. Yeah, it's kind of a no-brainer. And if you've done this, let's go on to number three. Number three says fill up again and record the number of gallons used. So, let's say we used eight gallons. And then number four says we have to record our mileage again. So let's say our ending mileage is 65,125 miles. Now, on number five, if we subtract number four from number one, we get 125 miles. Now, if we go down to number six, we divide that by the number of gallons, which is number three, and we come up with 15.625 miles per gallon. Now, and that's how you figure out your miles per gallon. But now, some people have also been asking me, well, how do you figure out the percentage of increase uh, when you do like a before and after test. Well, I've done a little thing down here too. A before test drive miles per gallon, let's say is 25 miles per gallon. And then we go to an after test drive and with our HHO, our booster system, whatever type of cell that you have, and you have an increase of let's say 50 miles per gallon. <laughs> That'd be awesome. And we end up with an increase or a difference of 100%. Now, let's say we only get like 31 miles to the gallon, then that would be a 24% increase. Let's say we get a 26.5, and we'd only have a 6% increase. And so anyway, we can go through and figure out all the different variations and what the percentage or the increase or difference is. Now, some people have been asking, what is the formula? And there it is down here. You got parentheses, parentheses, and then you would have your um, after test drive mileage minus your before test drive mileage, parentheses, divided by the uh, before test drive mileage, uh, another parentheses, times 100%. Uh, and that's the formula. And this is how you can calculate your miles per gallon and the increase in difference of your before and after test drive. Anyway, I hope this helps. Thanks. Bye.